card number one the assassination let's look at the artwork first beautiful painting Wanted for treason. Many people consider the assassination of JFK to be the moment that a coup d'etat was conducted in the United States of America, and those that assassinated JFK are still in power in the United States of America. They have never been brought to justice. Let's have a read through this. Let's get a little history on the way. Card number one, the assassination. Politics brought John Kennedy to Texas in 1963. The 35th president won the Congress, a uh, conservative state in the 1960 election, largely for his tough stand on Cuba. He, his promised defense buildup and his Texan running mate. But Kennedy's uh, 1,026 days in office were characterized by increasingly liberal policies. The failed 1961 Cuban Bay of Pigs invasion, the 1962 Cuban Missile Crisis, the 1963 Test Ban Treaty with the Soviets, and, in, and the administration's support of Martin Luther King and the Civil Rights Movement added to Kennedy's growing unpopularity in right-wing circles in the nine months before the president's visit to Dallas the Secret Service had uh, received more than 400 threats on his life on November 18 one of his one of these caused the cancellation of a planned motorcade through Miami in Texas a state dependent on the oil and defense industries recent moves to repeal the sacrosanct 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 27.5 percent oil depletion allowance and plans to begin withdrawal of u.s military advisors from vietnam were viewed with particular alarm nowhere nowhere more visibly than in dallas a hotbed of right-wing fringe activity in October 1963, UN Ambassador Adlai Stevenson had been had been shoved, spat on, and hit with picket sign picket sign there. When Kennedy read the Dallas Morning News on Friday morning, November 2nd, 22nd, he was greeted by a full-page ad in bold, black type, suggesting that he was a communist and a traitor. A few hours later, as he rode through downtown Dallas, accompanied by Dallas Governor John Con Conley and Vice President, President Lyndon Johnson, the motorcade route was lined with protesters picturing Kennedy with the words, wanted for treason. The stage was set for assassination. 